As countries around the world continue to criticize Russia over the war in Ukraine, former German Chancellor Angela Merkel defended her years-long policy of easing hostility against Moscow, adding that she had nothing to apologize for, even as the Russian conflict with Ukraine casts a dark cloud on her legacy. Listen in. Also, I see not that I should say that it was false. Und äh, werde deshalb auch mich äh, nicht entschuldigen. Und ich weiß auch nicht, was gewonnen worden wäre, wenn Putin einfach 2014 weitergemacht hätte und sich keiner darum gekümmert hätte. The veteran leader frequently met with Putin during her 16 years in power. She championed a commerce-driven pragmatic approach towards Moscow. But said that the February 24th invasion of Ukraine had marked a turning point. Merkel said that there was no justification for the war in Ukraine. Das ist ein brutaler, das Völkerrecht missachtender Überfall, für den es keine Entschuldigung gibt. She also warned that Putin wants to destroy Europe and that it was very important for the European Union to stick together. Adding that Putin made a big mistake. Merkel insisted that the 2014 to 2015 Minsk peace pacts were the best bet to end the fighting in the eastern Ukraine region. At the same time, adding that she was never under the illusion that closer trade links would spur democratic reform in Russia. Ich bin im Rückblick, wenn ich über alles summiere, eigentlich froh, dass ich mir nicht vorwerfen muss, ich habe es zu wenig versucht mit äh, ein, ein solches Ereignis, wie es jetzt stattgefunden hat, äh, zu verhindern. Mhm. Sondern ich habe es glücklicherweise ausreichend versucht, mit dem französischen, jeweiligen französischen Präsidenten zusammen. Und das Germany became hugely reliant on Russian energy imports during Merkel's tenure. She also worked Western allies with her backing for the controversial Nord Stream 2 pipeline. This double Russian gas deliveries to Germany. The project was shelved by the current Chancellor Olaf Scholz in late February over Russia's aggression. Germany has now joined the EU partners in a race to steer away Russian oil, gas and coal. Merkel has voiced support for her successor's decisions, adding that strength was the only language that Putin understood. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.